18 December 1899, Lord Roberts became the supreme commander of the British forces in South Africa after a series of unsuccessful campaigns against the Boer commandos during the Second Anglo-Boer War. The Bush executed preemptive strikes in Namafeking, Kimberley and Ladysmith, achieving morale-boosting victories in Colenso, Magersfontein and Spionskop. In one of these campaigns, Lord Roberts lost his only son. The colonial office then dispatched reinforcements under General Sir Redvers Henry Buller, who struggled to relieve besieged garrisons due to mismatched tactics and unexpected challenges, such as facing Boer commandos armed with German Mausers. Faced with these failures, the colonial office appointed Lord Roberts as Supreme Commander, and he, accompanied by Lord Kitchener, arrived in South Africa in early 1900. With increased troop numbers, Lord Roberts aimed to reverse the tide and secure a British victory at all costs.